Hello and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. It's Target Thursday and the new spring Hearth and Hand collection has arrived. Are you ready? Let's shop. How excited are you? I am super excited. You guys know I love Hearth and Hand. Starting off with a basket. What better way than to start off with a basket? These are $40 love of course this little plant i think i'm gonna have to get it straight away i'm already you know mentally shopping seven dollars for this one it looks so realistic it's really really cute i feel like it has more going on than, than the other ones that were right next to it because it kind of has a little cascading action going on this vase is 25 so cute love that as well this plant i feel like is not brand new if it is maybe the vase that it's sitting in the little pot for 35 dollars might be new but the greenery i feel like looks really similar to other things we've seen them uh do in the past 30 dollars for this vase container situation as you can see, this is like the taller version than the other one that we just saw. And then there's these. These are super cute. They're small though. Very small, but very, very cute. $17. I love the gold. Like the gold tone that Hearth and Hand does. Oh, look at me. You see this? <laughs> this is me showing you that I should be able to get this back up being the and i did being that the little hook thing can go in and out like that like one-handed it should be possible and it actually was but i love the gold the gold tone the hearth and hand uh does hearth and hands again love 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 we have some dried florals at first i was like oh are they different bundles they're not they're all the same, at least for right now. This is like straight off, you know, straight off the truck. I was going to say hot off the presses, but this is straight off the truck. Like the truck just arrived and things are being put out. <laughs> okay. This artificial tree is 120. I love it. I really like it. This might be like my next artificial tree. I have a, an olive tree and it's from here from target and it is hearth and hand but that one i got on sale i forget for how much at this point because i've had it for at least three or four years now and that's the only one i have this might be my next purchase it would be nice if it could go on sale though because you know you know me i don't want to pay 120 dollars for it i mean why, why 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 would i or should i you know both i need answers to both <laughs> these little boxes are 17 for this larger one it's a little storage box love the colors of course one of the reasons why i love hearth and hand it's like i feel like the colors oh this basket is 20 by the way matches the first one we just saw and these are the smaller versions these would be great they look perfect for either a closet or like a um pantry they look very pantry type baskets this mirror looks really nice a little you know again the gold finish all the way around but um i couldn't get the price i'm sorry apologies apologies i couldn't get the price this shocked me did you see what that says it's a plastic pump bottle but it's for shower gel i've never seen one that specifically said shower gel is what i'm saying here are their shower curtains which i'm actually in the market for like i'm looking for a shower curtain some of them are on sale for 15 dollars, but this one of course is the one that i would want and is it on sale no it's not it's 30 dollars, which i'm like i'm not doing that why again why would i <laughs> you know like no i can't pay full price for certain things and a shower curtain is one of them if i get it out of like home goods or tj maxx or marshall's that's one thing but from target i need it to be on sale I, and you know i'm over here saying how much i love hearth and hand but that doesn't mean i want to pay full price for everything 
I mean, come on. <laughs> <laughs> here is the toilet paper holder 25 dollars i love it i feel like they judged it up a little they've had this before but you see that little base thing at the bottom the little circle like i feel like they like i said they judged it up a little you know um but i do like it it's really nice here are their towels for 13 dollars and then they have these these bath hooks which i was looking at and i'm like yes i love because it's black they're five dollars but i'm like how exactly do you put them on the wall it just looks weird do you see this do you see what i'm doing dropping it but what's new you know i act i it took long enough really i'm surprised it didn't happen at the very beginning now these shower curtain rings they've had in the past they're ten dollars but i always love them like i just love the simplicity but very usefulness of the hooks and just of like the way that hearth and hand is built, <laughs> you know, like I just, there's a thing, there's a thing about it that is just right up my alley. $15 for that tray. Very, very nice. Then out of the corner of my eye, I noticed that they have the waste baskets. Remember the other day I couldn't get my life together and couldn't figure out how to what to call these <laughs> it's $25 they are waste baskets for the bathroom or whatever they could even be for the office you know you do what you wish with it this one is also 25 hiding in the back a woven waste basket right here very nice these are really really good and then they have the entire collection down here of all the little woven things the tray right here for 15 and then these little baskets again i feel like they had this before but they kind of judged it up they tend to do that sometimes it'll be the same line like the woven line just like this one but they'll tweak it a little you know just just trim it a little do you guys know where that one is from just just trim it a little it's from a movie. I'll give you a hint. It's from a movie that I quote often enough, but it's not a line that you would remember unless you're obsessed with the movie the way that my, I am and my family and my mostly myself and my siblings. That's all I'll say about that. Did you see the gold tray and the gold tissue cover? Do you see what I mean about their gold? It's so good. I love it. And then this milky white. Yes, please. This is what actually drew me to this bath section was the fact that I saw all this like beautiful white. It's so good. $15 for this little container. And then this one is just slightly bigger for 20. Love the lids, of course. All the towels. And then these mirrors right here. And again, I apologize. There. Hi. Hello. A little, a little head pop. Um, I couldn't get the price. I'm sorry. Apologies. Apologies. <laughs> Seven dollars for the mugs. Guys, were the mugs not? Didn't they used to be $4.99? That's one thing I did notice. I'm excited about the collection being out because yes. I'm always going to be excited about that. $10 for these little ex espresso cups. Um, <laughs> but the prices, the price point has definitely gone up on some items. Just saying. $20 for the mug tree. So if you're buying the mugs, there's the mug tree. Measuring cups with the wood handles. Love, 17 and these are in the um, stainless steel. And then look at this. All of a sudden, it was like as if I wasn't seeing it and then I noticed it and got excited. 25 for the utensil holder. It's nice and heavy. I kind of like it. I wish it had more of a gray tone or like... I say that only because I want it to match my kitchen, but really, I'm really gravitating, just like I was for Christmas, to browns and wait till you see all of the brown things. By the way, do you see this? What? That was very different and new. A compost container? 
Okay. Very nice. This guy is back, the measuring cup. The mini tongues. They've also had these in the past. Very cute for seven. I love their little utensils. If you're new here, just know. Well, you already found out. <laughs> you messed around and found out that I love Hearth and Hand. But also, their little utensils. Like this item right here, the spoon rest for $5. I just purchased this one a couple of weeks ago. I pointed to the black measuring cups because those are basically, they're called classics at this point. Like, that is just always going to be here. This little tray matches the utensil holder that I was just checking out before that we just saw. And then here is the napkin, the paper towel holder, really. The paper towel holder for 17. I love their little utensils. Like I love all of their little kitchen gadgets and such. And I'm not like a gadgety person at all. How cute is this little plate? $5. Squirrel! <laughs> How quickly I can move on to the next. It's so cute though. I was actually thinking after the fact, of course, because you know I couldn't shop during the actual walkthrough, but I'm like, this little plate would be so cute for Margot, Margot Eloise, our kitty, for her little snacks. Like I could put her little snacks on there. How cute would that be? Love this whole section. Love the um, coasters. You know I'm a coaster fan. We use coasters in my home all the time. It's a thing. And it's, you know, we just, that's just what we do and we're very used to it. So, yes, I'm always checking out coasters, but love these. $15 for this little pepper and salt and pepper little, you know, situation. Okay, this right here, I want to talk to you about this. It's $15, right? I purchased it a few months ago. I just noticed literal this week that it's not the best. It is not the best. So disclaimer, I've used it. Now here's the review <laughs> because I'm noticing that the oil, it, like it comes down the sides after a while, like the lid on there, the little suction thingy, it's not, it's not doing what it's supposed to do. You know, it's not the best. I still love Hearth, Hearth and Hand though. Like, you know, I'm not going to not like them because that is happening. But I will say I'm not super impressed. It looks great on the counter, but just saying functionality. I don't know. Just moving on, moving on. Look at this. Do you see the struggle? The struggle. And then I'm like, look at it. It's right. I mean, why does this happen to me every single time? You know that this happens to me every single time. So easily available right here, but I'm over here struggling with it, almost dropping it and all. It's $45. I think it's really cute. Look at all the brown. This is what I was telling you. I love it. $19 for this one. Here's the bigger one. Love the little lid, how they did that little handle. 20 for the larger one. Isn't this good? It's like a really good brown. Speaking of which, that reminds me that <laughs> I was saying that heart and hand is like very neutral, but with a little bit of color at the same time, like it's brown. There's that hunter green that they love to do. What other color do they do? look at this i mean it's all very neutral of course but i just feel like they do they, they give it they give it a little sass to it that i just love this i might have to purchase it's four pieces so it's really two because they count the lid so it's this bowl and then there's one smaller love the brown forty dollars for this set kind of love it kind of love it Lots of their wooden pieces. We've seen those before, so we're not wasting time this time around on all of those. We're focusing on all the new, you know? $4 for this little tumbler. How cute is it? It's so cute. And then, of course, here's the green that we were just talking about. They have a juicer. They have a hand juicer. This is so cute. Do you see what I mean? 
Are we in agreement with this? It's eight dollars. Like with their little utensils, they just go about it in a way that like you wanna. It's cute. You wanna have it on display. It's giving all the vibes, you know. This table, it's one hundred and seventy dollars. I like it. I think it's actually one of their nicer ones. It's not super tall. Because when I look at this, I'm thinking, oh, could it be a like bedside table? And I guess it could, but it's a, I feel like it's a little bit short. It's a little bit small. Stanley's, the Stanley's are back. The special colors, the limited edition colors, here they are. So you just saw all the prices right there. So, you know, if you need to pause it and take a good look, go for it because I figured Whenever they give me a sign like that, I'm going to show you the sign so that I don't have to like, you know, show you every single price for every item. But the cup, the last item we just grabbed that the infamous, you know, everybody must have. Did you know that like that was like one of the most gifted items this past Christmas? Just, you know, this past Christmas, like it was that long ago, you know, last week. <laughs> <laughs> but apparently that was the most gifted item especially within like the teen community and like early 20s that's crazy i will say i love the colors i do like the colors and then look at this this is new as far as i'm concerned i've never seen hearth and hand do a juicer like this it's thirty dollars you know, it's like old school. You see what I mean about like how they go about doing things? It just has like that, not vintage, but just a look of where you want to have it on your counter. You want to display it. But at the same time, it's functional. Except for my oil dispenser. <laughs> the berries, by the way. The berries. Uh, what are they straining? What is that? What is that velvet? Now, let's speak about this, actually. Forget about the berries. Uh, what are they What are, What are they called? Uh, um, strainers? Um, colanders. The colanders. Do you see this right here? I kid you not, I thought it was a rug. It is $20, which is a great price point as far as I'm concerned, because look at how huge this runner is. This is a table runner, guys. I couldn't believe it. I was just like, what? It's huge. It's definitely extra wide. That's for sure. And then comes this collection. $20 for the pitcher. I'm obsessed. I love it. I know. I said I love the browns that they're doing, but I'm also loving the whites. This is so pretty. I think I also just love the shape. I definitely love the shape of these canisters. This one is 23, more than the shapes of what they did with the brown ones that we just saw. Look at this bowl. It's $25, it's gigantic. And again, like the shape, the little bit of like how it widens at the top. You, do you see that little lip? It's so good. And it's really, like I said, it's huge. These little coffee containers been around for a few months now. So there they are. Did you see that one almost wanted to fall? I had to step away. More of the wood items. And then look, the collection continues. But wait, there's more. And so it's an entire full collection. We have the mugs for $7, which by the way, I feel like we didn't finish talking about the fact that the mugs used to be $4.99, maybe $5.99, now they're six. Well, actually seven, because they're $6.99. $5 for the bowl, like a little cereal bowl. Then this is kind of like a salad bowl, I would say. Oh, it says pasta bowl. $10 though, don't like that. That price point is absurd. $5 for the plate, and this is the smaller plate. I'm sure they probably have the bigger plate. I did not see that here at my store. But again, I mean, perfect example. This is still wrapped. The items are still coming out. 
We could almost even consider this a preview, even though there are so many new items already on display. I'm sure there's going to be more to come, or at least like, you know, the finishing of certain collections that we're taking a look at today. The scale, beautiful. Another item that's just like has that look of let's keep it on the counter because it's just so cute. So here's the KitchenAid items. As you may or may not know, Hearth and Hand has like a whole Hearth and Hand and KitchenAid collab, if you will. Of course, no prices on these, but it's a coffee grinder and the handheld mixer and whatnot. And here they are on display. I've never seen them on display like this. So I guess they're really trying to, you know, try something different. How cute are these? Remember they had this for Christmas? $20, but it was the large one. It was like the really big one. Like it went all the way across and it had that little flower look. Well, now they're giving it to us in just like the three. And you see this one? How cool is this? So that's for a tapered candle. Usually it would be for like, um, I was gonna say a pillar candle. Is that what they would be called? But you know, the bigger, thicker candles. Well, this one is for a tapered candle. And I think a tapered candle in like a lantern like that would look so good. Now, I just showed you this whole wall, the greenery, all the things, lots of new items over here. Tic-tac-toe, you know I love it. $30 though for it, I was upset. I was upset when I saw that because I really want this one and I don't know that I'm willing to pay the $30. The dust, the dustpan situation, also love. I, again, on the list, I want it. It's $25. Now I will say I could possibly be willing to pay the $25 for the dustpan maybe here's another kind of like random weird not weird but you know an item that i was just like super surprised it's a watering utensil it's a watering gadget if you will twenty dollars how cool is that i thought that was very cool very different which again it's kind of like what i love about hearth and hand these balls love Every single one is different. There's like, they're one of a kind, if you will. And then my true love, my true hearth and hand love, this tray. I own it. I want another one, but I don't want to pay $40. It is $40. And I just wish they would put it on sale one day for me. And that, that dream just hasn't happened. I was trying to push that other tray in, as you saw. And I'm like, why isn't this thing going all the way in? There was like one of those little shelf things that they have all the way back there that was what was keeping it from going all the way so the wreath of course i think they're gonna have more because usually they have like a good three or four new wreaths for each collection so so far that's just the one which is 40 the larger one and then the smaller one as you just saw for i believe that's at 20 and then the greenery the stems by the way I think Hearth and Hand has some of the best greenery out there. Like, I think they do such a great job. $10 for the big long stems. I wanted to make sure because sometimes they have like $15 ones, but these are not it. But meanwhile, these are very big. I own this one, the shorter one. I want to get this one. It's 30. It's kind of like the tray. I want them both but I don't want to pay the full price. Just saying. This plan stand for $50 is not okay. I love it. It's beautiful. But for $50 for a plan stand? I mean, that needs to be a, a side table. <laughs> that needs to be... I need to be like putting my drink on there, not a plant. I don't know. Is it just me? Now these planters though, love so cute with the scallops i love it i almost forgot to show you these some new artwork 23 dollars. this is the smaller one it's so hard to see i was trying my hardest maybe right here probably is the best 
but it's very light, very grayish, you know, it's not colorful or anything. Here's the larger one that, you know, coordinates with it. I did take a look at the price. I had to put the camera down. I had to do all the things and it is $40 for the artwork. This little pot is the cutest. How cute is that? I feel like you could use it for so many other things, not just for an actual plant, like on your desk for like, you know, pens and pencils and such. And then there's the watering cans. This is the spring collection and we're going to be seeing a lot of spring all over the place. We're going to see all of the watering cans. Do you guys remember last year? I mean, everyone was going on a watering can frenzy now i will say this gold one right here is usually my favorite the y12 both of the hearth and hand watering cans are they're like top i really really love them these frames are beautiful 23 dollars for this larger one and then here's the smaller one for 17 i even like the little kickstand in the back like how good is that i love it they did a very good job with these frames this time $13 for the mister. And here are the pillows and the throw blankets. I'm just going to give you an overview for now. I feel like they were missing a good amount, but here's at least this one blanket, which is super cozy, very soft. It's $50. Talk about a price range hike <laughs> okay but it's beautiful and like i said soft it didn't feel scratchy it felt very nice of course i had to show you the toys i love hearth and hand toys they do all the wood stuff these blocks are so cute 30 dollars for the set but you're not gonna believe what's already out like we're talking spring meanwhile we're in winter wait till you see what we're about to see I'll just wait till we see it. This uh, candle scent is called Ivy. I love it. I think they did such a good job with this container because, you know, I feel like you're mostly paying for the, for the vessel. It's $30. I love that it's clear glass with that nice gold lid. So good. It's very heavy to lift with one hand, but, you know, I did it. Now, here's one of the items the bunny you heard what i said the bunny <laughs> the easter items are starting to trickle in guys easter okay just saying here they are and they're beautiful so good here's the easter basket for 15 dollars that wire one underneath it is also an Easter basket, but they've done that one before. We've seen it many times. So this is the new one. And then I thought that was it. No, the Easter bunny's here. Okay. And it is super cute holding the little carrot. It's $13. Love. Here's all of the candles. They do have this new candle in all of their usual scents, like all of their classic scents, Hearth and Hand pretty much I've noticed through the years, they just do the same scent and put it in different containers for the different seasons and whatnot. Here's the snuffer, $10, very cute, hiding in the back. And that is going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Click the notification bell so you won't miss any of my upcoming videos. Let's keep the party going by clicking on one of these videos right here on the screen. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!